So recently, there's been a lot of buzz around Resident Evil 4 recently with the update that we got for Mercenaries because Mercenaries did get some pretty disappointing news. We're missing two major characters, Wesker and Ada, but they're going to be coming along later down the line with dlc that's how a lot of people are imagining it's going to be happening because currently they are in the files for the game but that's not what i wanted to focus on today with yeah the update that came out recently too we also got some uh pretty uh pretty concerning news not just for a resident evil 4 remake but also for the future of capcom titles and just resident evil 2 now before i do state anything this is just going to be pretty much my opinion and simply put it it's not that big of a deal now let's put this into perspective the game is kind of paid to win now no doubt about it it is going to be paid to win but it's a single player game it's not multiplayer it's not you against anyone else it's just single player now resident evil 4 remake you could either choose to buy these microtransactions and that's pretty much the biggest topic of this video there are finally microtransactions now is this something huge kind of but is it really jaw dropping i'm gonna go ahead and say no because they have put other microtransactions in other resident evil games i mean in resident evil 8 they put the microtransaction where you can buy all of the weapons that you could earn from the extra content shop that was a feature i mean people really aren't mm, addressing that either into this argument which i mean it does have some validity to it but i mean the transact the microtransactions that are being added to resident evil 4 remake are just a little bit more concerning you can absolutely go ahead and finish this game with no microtransactions paid for does it give those players that want that little edge a bit of a boost yes a hundred percent but quite honestly i don't really mind it i mean i'm not gonna go ahead and buy everything i'm not gonna go ahead and spend money on this game i mean it's you know i've already bought a lot for it i mean i'm not gonna go out of my way to just spend more that i don't really need to i mean there really is no purpose i've already spent enough you know i get it i'm gonna have to spend money for the dlc that is separate ways i still have a strong feeling that this is going to be coming out paid for now that's pretty much gonna have to wrap up today's video that's it's not a long video i didn't really want to make it too long talking about some microtransactions because that is a very controversial topic to talk about with in video games especially call of duty battlefield and like all those type of AAA games you know i do think microtransactions are really horrible but some of them aren't even that bad and i do think a lot of people kind of take a lot of it a little too serious but that's gonna have to wrap up guys i hope you guys definitely did enjoy it, and i'll catch you guys later peace out